Hello everyone, my name is Prosper and in this video I'm going to be sharing with you how to change the PHP version uh, of your website in Ostinger. So if you are using Ostinger and for any reason whatsoever you want to change your PHP version, I'm going to be putting you through step by step on how to go about it. So before we get into the video, if you are new here, kindly take out time to click on that subscribe button to subscribe to the channel and also on that bell icon so that you can get notified of subsequent videos. All right, so thank you very much if you have just done that and if you have if you haven't please 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 just click on that subscribe button it's actually just one click and it's free all right so to do that once you have logged into your hosting gel account come over to website so here you see a little of websites that you currently have on your hosting gel account so let's say for example i want to change the php version for this particular domain on this particular website lipo 360 com. so i'll head over to manage so on this side of the on this screen you just come towards the left you see advanced with a gear icon so click on advanced and then you see php configuration so click on php configuration and then you'll be having the screen so here you can select whatever php version that you want to use and then if it you want to do some php extension maybe you want to check or uncheck certain php extension you also do it here and then if you come to php options also there are also other things that you might want to do maybe like um, increase your upload upload limits or your upload file size because this is one of the common things that you might want to do here and any other settings that you want to adjust post uh, max size and what have you so basically that's the process it's very simple once you are there you go to your website you come to the left side of the screen advanced you see your php version and then you can easily say so once you are done changing anything here just make sure you update it and then you see that the changes will come up live on your website so that is it guys on how to change php version i hope you find value in this video if you do please give it a thumbs up and if you have any questions or any comments i uh, do endeavor to put them in the comment section below so thank you very much and i'll see you all in another video